daughters, I max. I will be, and I am as we speak, asking them to see more patients, to say yes when there has to be a connection between primary care and, and secondary care. I'm asking them to modify their practices. Do you think doctors, the way they behave and think, they will say yes to a modification of their day-to-day -day practices? The answer is always no. If you are to be asked to, to change the, your way of doing things, the answer is always no. And when they came, they came in the midst or at the end of the, the last negotiations that were, that were not exactly... Uh, a happy time for them. So when they came, they came in the in a very specific mood. That was not exactly not, not a good mood. Not a good mood. Right. Now that I speak with them, they're not necessarily in the better mood, but they are in a different mood because they understand that I intend to go forward and I intend to ask them seriously. And it's already been done, and they are reflecting on this. You can ask them what I'm asking them to do. I'm asking them to do things differently and. Differently means really changing their way of approaching uh, medical care in this province. And to them, it's a huge set. When I say to GPs that they have to, to make room for nurses, do you believe that they, uh, they receive that, uh, that request with uh, great enthusiasm? Certainly not. So, so, so if, if, let me just finish this one because it's, it's important to me because it goes to the whole thing. In parliamentary commissions, I had three groups, only three, not two, not four. I had, no, not, not, not three, four groups. I had doctors, organizations, two. They were against for the reasons I've just said. I said unions. I don't know if you looked at the parliamentary commissions, if you followed them or not. If you did not, go back to last Wednesday and listen to the first 10 minutes, their own presentation of FTQ. They did not pronounce the word PL10, not PL, not 10, not PL10. It was a requisitory against government, period. I mean, you, they nurse. Have, they have many issues. Beyond. Many issues, many issues, right. all issues that are not related to uh, Bill 10. Right. Nurses came out uh, with a memoir, and the last page of the memoir is how to save $10 billion in. Uh, to, to get $10 billion in savings in government by increasing taxes and, uh, and, uh, and, and, and cons consumer taxes across the board in this province. Do you think we can do that? But that's their position. Their position is a classic union position left to the left and has nothing to do with Bill 10. Then we had two other groups. We had universities. Universities, if you recall, they were in favor. No one came out at University 11 against. Miguel did not come out. Sh uh, Montreal did not come out. Sherbrooke came made and made a presentation that was f almost exactly 100% of what we were asking them to do. They're already doing that. Uh, um, uh, Laval, the same thing. Laval just asked us to... To, do, to, to go ahead and make one CIS, a university CIS, uh, keep uh, Laval University as it is and separate the uh, Heart Institute of Quebec. No big deal to me. And the other groups were users who came, multiple groups representing users. And they all said for the most part, not all, but for the most part what they said, they said that they agreed with uh, the objective and the goal Of the, of the bill, but they were worried about uh, the guarantees that it will end that way. And I understand that. And they expressed worries, especially the English-speaking community and others uh, in some aspects of the bill that I try to answer, and I will answer, and again, there will be amendments that will, I believe, satisfy each and every one. So it is not true to say that everybody is against. Some people are forcibly again. There are no way for them to be for in, the, in their mindset. And there are those in the middle. Those in the middle who say, well, if it doesn't work the way you're saying, uh, well, it's going to be bad. But if it does, it's going to be good. Well, let's hope it's going to work the way it's presented.